Tropical Storm Idalia is making its way east toward Franklin County and locals are preparing for the storm. Grocery stores and gas stations are among the busiest places residents are going to stock up. As News 13's Courtney Fegley reports, locals are not taking this storm lightly. Idalia is making its way to the Gulf Coast and is expected to make landfall early Wednesday morning. Many people are out filling their cars with gas, buying groceries, and those close to the coastline are barricading their homes. Right now we are prepared. We have food. We have all our gas tanks are full. We have water. Items such as water, peanut butter, bread, and toilet paper are flying off the shelves. Piggly Wiggly manager Lee McElmore says the grocery store will be open during the storm as long as conditions don't worsen. We're prepared with with all the products here in the store that uh, we need to have for the customer. And then we have a lot of resources that we can bring things in here. If we have to get emergency trucks brought in from our warehouse to replenish product, we can do that. Franklin County is one of the areas that is expected to be impacted more significantly by the storm. There are no plans for evacuation so far, but that can change if the storm system gets stronger and more dangerous. Franklin County Sheriff A.J. Smith urges locals to heed warnings if they are asked to evacuate. If a mandatory evacuation is announced, then evacuate. If the weather's too bad, we're going to be sheltering in place until the storm passes. We're not leaving the county, but we're not going to go out in a 110 mile an hour wind to answer a call for service. In East Point, Courtney Fegley, News 13, Panhandle Strong. To stay up to date on the storm, you can go to our website, mypanhandle.com.